Hi, this is Matt from tracingmat.co.uk and here to arrive this morning courtesy of uh, Clove Technology I have the uh, new HTC Touch HD. Um, as you can see, HTC have done away with the funny shaped box that they had with the Touch Diamond and the Touch Pro um, which was plastic. Obviously this is now cardboard, more conventional with the magnetic catch on the front which opens up to reveal the Touch HD inside. We'll look at that in more detail in just a second. Just want to have a look at what else we have in the box. There's an inside box which has a number of bits and pieces in it. First of all we have a UK plug, a spare stylus which uh, is not telescopic, it's fixed length and quite weighty. We have a USB to mini USB cable which is pretty standard. There is the charger itself which is USB style. We have a wired headset, which is a three and a half mil jack, four pole, because it has an inline inline microphone just there, which has a push button for releasing and uh, answering your calls. And on the other end, we obviously have the headphones, which are pretty HTC standard, um, which aren't too bad. There's also a um, couple of foam covers for the headphones. Then we have a case, which is like a soft, almost um, suede uh, finish to it. It is lined, um, not bad. It's uh, you know, no clip, belt clip or anything like that. It is literally just a, a soft pouch. Uh, there's the battery which is pretty slim, it's 1560 milliamp hours. Finally on the bottom of the box we have an 8 micro SD card which uh, I understand is supplied with all the versions, even the uh, orange exclusive version will have an 8, 8 gig micro SD. And uh, last of all in the main box we have the uh, manuals uh, as a screen protector uh, manuals, getting started guide, uh, a couple of CD-ROMs which include uh, the user manual on CD-ROM and also Active Sync getting started on, on CD-ROM there. So let's, so let's have a look at the HTC Touch HD. Um, let's peel off the screen protector. Interestingly, HTC have started putting these notices on uh, their devices to uh, prevent damage, please don't have the device in your pocket when you sit down or in actual fact don't have it in your pants when you sit down so clearly means something slightly different here in the UK to uh, to the US let's just put the battery in which goes in the back here get it around the right way as so this is where a sim card goes and the micro SD card there's also a small reset button just in the back there so uh, in order to press the reset button with the with the stylus you do have to remove the back cover um, which I think personally slightly defeats the object because uh, to be honest if I'm going to remove the back cover it's just as easy to remove the battery than to get the stylus out and to push that reset button but hey ho on the back while we're looking there then uh, there is a 5 megapixel autofocus camera uh, which we'll look at in more detail with some of the shots um, say autofocus no cover over it though um, unlike some of the other products that are coming out at the moment with actually lens cover and uh, interestingly no flash of any kind and then there's a small grill over the loudspeaker there so let's uh, look back to the front we have uh, a forward-facing VGA camera for video conferencing and then also obviously the actual loudspeaker on the front there for uh, you know, in call so then we have the HTC Touch HD's main feature which is the uh, 3.8 inch WVGO display which is 480 by 800 uh, a lovely generous display there we have a uh, touch sensitive vet panel at the bottom which uh, includes the send and end phone keys home and a back button um, although I say buttons they're not physical buttons they are just touch sensitive uh, area there looking down the left hand side we have a large up down rocker for volume control there is the USB or say mini USB connector on the bottom which is used for sync and charge uh, whether or not the HTC uh, headphones that you can get on other devices will work here we don't know um, and it's still slightly unclear as to whether or not there is a video out we suspect there isn't video out through there but 
we're not 100% sure, we're waiting for confirmation on that from HTC. Stylus slides in at the bottom. Again, as I say, fixed length stylus, not telescopic, quite weighty. Nothing else down the right hand side. And then just on top, we have, thankfully, a 3.5mm standard jack, so we can use any headphones with the Touch HD, which uh, is a real excellent thing. No adapters uh, required here. Then we've obviously got the power button. We've already looked at the back. So let's uh, turn the Touch HD on. And just uh, while, it, while it's starting up, let's just kill the lights so we can have a look at the screen a little bit more clearly. And while we're waiting for that to come on, let's just talk through the specification. As we know, Windows Mobile 6.1, professional with touch screen clearly. Uh, Qualcomm processor at 528 MHz. There's 288 MB of RAM and 512 MB of ROM. And if we just quickly run through the setup. And uh, we'll just skip through all this. As you can see, that's a real nice size display.